Well, the central government has allocated $100 million for the repair of 12 diamond vessels for use by the Trinidad and Tobago Coast Guard. These vessels have been out of commission for several years, hindering the officers from effectively carrying out their duties. The vessels were discussed at the Standing Finance Committee of Parliament. Here's more in this report. Although it has been proposed previously, the repairs of the 12 Damnan vessels will be carried out in fiscal year 2024, according to Minister of National Security Fitzgerald Hines. Opposition MP Devinder Nathan Koo pointed out that in fiscal year 2023, $15 million was allocated for the vessel repairs, but only $15,000 was expanded. When questioned about this, Heinz explained that the evaluation of repairs and the procurement services took longer than anticipated. We, of course, the procurement of those and the negotiations with the, the service provider were ongoing and we are really now at the cusp of it. We have gotten to that place. The Ministry of National Security has allocated over $100 million for the repair of the 12 Damnon vessels. The operations of the Trinidad and Tobago Coast Guard have been hampered for several years due to the need for repairs on most of their vessels. This situation left Tobago without a vessel based on the island. Interceptors were assigned to Tobago in 2017. However, they have been out of service for approximately four years. The repair of interceptors was not included in the draft estimates for fiscal 2024. But according to Heinz, the repair of the Damnin vessels will benefit the entire country. So we will do that. And insofar as their deployment is concerned, that is a matter that will be left to those who are more technically and legally competent so to do. Suffice it to say that I am confident that with the resailing and utilization of those 12 vessels, it should logically and we anticipate take us a long way to improve, improving our border security. Regarding the reasons why the Coast Guard's almost entire fleet of the Damnan vessels is in need of repairs, Minister Hines explained that it is due to natural wear and tear. And as vessels go, they would need upgrade, maintenance, and this uh, allocation is in anticipation of that. However, the minister did not address future maintenance of the vessels to prevent reoccurrence of the situation where the majority of Coast Guard vessels are out of service for repairs. Candace Jackson, Tobago Updates, Television News.